Welcome back, travelers of Decider Havoc here, and we are back playing a little more Project Ozone 2 on Kappa Mode. And let me start off by apologizing for my last couple episodes. I know I didn't, I wasn't sounding like my normal self, and I was under the weather, but I really wanted to get some videos because I was going on a little mini staycation kind of thing, not staycation, but a vacation. Um, and so I was trying to get my last two videos recorded, but I really was feeling under the weather and I've been trying so hard to, you know, keep up doing my, you know, one episode a day. So I kind of forced myself to do something that, you know, was lesser quality. So f let me apologize. Um, I was kind of watching those as they, I, I reposted them or whatever, and I just did not like the quality of them. So my apologies, but we're back. We are back and we have some stuff planned today. The first thing I want to do is I want to finish up what we were doing at the end of last episode because I was able to get enough cinnamon now. <laughs> and so I, uh, hey, get back here, get back here. Um, yeah, I want to get that done. So let us get that one complete. Um, there we go. There we go. 16 of those. Now we can make some French toast and get that accomplishment knocked out and i did oh you know what i need i need wheat don't i that's what i need cool because we're gonna go um oh well let me see if i do I have any seeds in here um we're gonna go and show you some of the stuff i've done in the meantime in preparation for you know future episodes and stuff like that so we are gonna head back to the farm oh well i just got an egg we're gonna head back to the farm i'm gonna show you guys a couple things that i've done so, uh, part of it will make sense in today's episode. Oh my gosh, the lag is real here. I need to figure out a way to prevent that or isolate it. I set up another rancher over here. I haven't prettied up the area yet, but I set up another rancher to ranch oil. So then we can use the refinery to make uh, gasoline. And I think I have figured out a relatively decent way to run that refinery, but it's still pretty much a work in progress. And so, yeah, so we've got oil just kind of showing you that. I did start, and that's actually part of what I want to show you. I now have dye seeds to put down. So we are making lots and lots of dye, and that way I won't have to worry about that in the future. And then I also laid down a different crop field over here of Menincio seeds, electrical steel, uh, energetic alloy, and dark steel. Because I figured, you know what, let's start using these fields for some more useful things. And I believe the other one I just laid down. Nope, that was it. Yeah, that's it. So, yeah, that's that's what we got going on here. Uh, the reason I'm here is just because I need to plant some wheat seeds real quick and get some wheat so we can make some toast and all that fun stuff. So, what are you? You're my nature seeds. We'll just pick you up. My image is empty. We're going to do this really, really quickly. Um, wheat sticks. There we go. And let's get you planted up real quick, like so. I think I have 10, 10, 10 wheat seeds, and I think I just didn't grab them. But it doesn't look like I'm going to really need them. That's pretty fast. And I only need like 16 of these. You know what? We're going to make this even faster. Um, come here. Because even if I don't get the harvest, the, the harvester will. There we go. Let's get that growing. <clears throat> and I'll just put in the inventory system for me. So thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And it's so weird that you can't click on the sticks, but you can click away from them and come back over with your thing with the watering can. But anyway, so yeah, so we're gonna get some wheat stuff or whatever today, but today we're going to continue on the path that we're doing. I want to get that mechanism stuff done so we can start planning for uh, Galacticraft. And I, I'm from all the comments I've read or not comments, but like, you know, the forums and stuff like that. That is the path that opens up um, 17. Perfect. Okay. Let's go ahead and put my other seeds back down. That is the branch that I have to do to open up Galacticraft so we can start doing that. Because I can't even explain how much I want to finish Alpha. Like, it, that's the whole reason. I mean, obviously, it's all, you know, evolution towards a game or whatever. But I so want to finish Alpha. It has been lingering for too long, and all I need is one little mercury ingot. Like, everything else, super, super simple, but that. So, let us take our wheat and craft that into wheat flour, and then we'll throw it over here, and within, like, half a second, it'll be done. Boop. And then you turn into toast. Boop. And now we should have everything we need for French toast. Should. 
Doesn't mean we're going to, but huh, should have everything for French toast. So, is that it? Cool. How many can I make? Oh, you can only make one at a time because of the pot. No, the pot stays there. What? Is it sugar I need again? No, I have sugar. Um, I have eggs. I have some... Let's just put all this stuff in the system real quick. We're going to make this happen. Come on. I know I have tons and tons of eggs. Why are you not working? Let's take you out and let's wait for you to get back in the system. There we go. 10. Boop. That's 16. That should be achievement. Ha ha ha. Achievement complete. Cool. So, like I was saying, I planted those dye essences. So, um... There they are. What are they called? Uh, Technicolor Essence, right? So we've already got 6,000 of them. I think we're good. I think we're good. So now we want to take a look at that epic bacon. I'm pretty sure it was all just dyes. I think that's why I couldn't do it. Yeah, it's a uh, pork chop or, you know, some kind of meat or whatever. Cooked pork chop or tofu. And I should have plenty. The actual objective is for... Hey, what are you doing? Okay. It is... Um, how many do I need? We need, oh, only four. That's easy. So let me grab some pork. Uh, yeah, there we go. I've got plenty. We'll just cook some of this up. I'm sure I'll probably end up using it for food again eventually. Mm. I mean, let's be honest. The the toast, toast tea lover's order. I thought it was called like a toast sandwich, but interesting. Okay. Um, so we need to make each one of the dyes. Or it's not each one. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, but whatever. We need epic bacon. So is it any random dyes or it doesn't have to be red, purple? Okay, so it has to be these. Okay. So I need the regular dye. So red, I can make you like that. There we go. And purple, I can make you like that. I like the Technicolor dyes for that reason. Like it's just some random shape and that is that color. That's, it's pretty cool actually. So we've got this. This is going to be super simple now. There we go. And magenta, come on, give me the right one. There it is. And we can make that like a so. And which one do I need? Green. I can make cactus green simple. There we go. Hey, what are you doing? And blue. Nope, you're not blue. Stuff the nonsense. I need regular blue. Oh, lapis. Duh, I can do lapis. All right, cool. So we should be able to make the epic base now. Why aren't you going? Is my inventory system finally full? Do I need more storage drawers? That's kind of crazy. Um, I guess I'll just grab all the individual items. That's fine. Uh, pork chop. You go there. And green. If I can spell, you go there. Oh, and lapis. And lapis I have plenty of. Boop. There we go. Epic bacon. Six of them. That should be accomplished. Or did I just shift click it out and because I shift clicked it out, it didn't work. I can't win. I can't win. <laughs> Oh, the whole shift clicking thing. It, it hasn't been with every item, but it's been with a lot of them. So let's try that again. Pork. I have you. Oh, I need to make all those again. Okay, you know what? I'm going to call that complete and we're going to do it again because I have to go make all those dyes and I'm not going to spend any more time doing that. But basically, Epic Bacon is pretty freaking sweet. If you see, it's a full um, meat sickles and full... Um, saturation so that stuff's pretty epic i think epic is a good name for that all right cool so we have accomplished that we'll, I'll, I'll do it later we'll, we'll do it later <clears throat> um so b is getting pretty close to compete i can't make this until i make the furnace um and then you know the master infusion stones a bit of ways away because that thing I, I, i've showed you how to make that one or whatever so we're going to be back to the book back to the book back to the book okay so we're in epsilon right so the reason we started this was because we want to make this and we've got the pressure chamber now, right? Right. However, I have to make some items for that. So 
P R E S. See, I still I still can't spell today. Good grief. Um, oh no, wait, I'm looking up machine casing. This guy right here. Okay, so I need to make a machine frame, some black plastic, and some steel. Now, I think I have black plastic. I think I've gotten it before in, um, I have not. Okay, so we're gonna have to make plastic, and then we're gonna have to make those, um, the machine frames. And this, I do remember, there was a reason that I kind of stopped here, and it was because this machine frame right here, we need that Ferris gear, right? And we realized I can't make the Ferris gear without making the uh, instant immersion press. So that is what we're gonna be working on right now. I'm gonna finally make the stupid thing and just be done with it. So press, oh, you know what? I'm gonna need the book. Um, immersion, oh, it's not instant immersion. What is it? Em or immersive, immersive. Um, at immer oh the books right here what am I thinking it's in my darn bookshelf engineering manual that's what it's called all right so we probably are looking for heavy machinery I'm assuming and the metal press yes okay so it looks like we're gonna need three steel scaffolding haha <laughs> perfect uh, two conveyors one piston and one of those okay um, and then the press is steel plates around any other plate. We can do that. We can do that. So immersive. Why can't I spell? There we go. So I'm going to need three of these, which means I'm going to need. Oh, well, that'll do it. Uh, do I have any in there? Yes, because I had my old. Um, uh, what's it called? Yeah, that one thing, you know, that one thing that did that one thing. Um, that right there, um, where is the heavy duty one? This is the, this one. I think it's this one. Heavy engineer block. I should have all of those materials. I do. Sweet. And then just a piston. Okay. Sweet. Now I need to make some steel plates. So I need to grab my hammer. I don't have one. Where in the world is my immersive? You know what? I probably exhausted it. I use it a lot uh, to make buckets. So let's make it. Let's like make like two of these, shall we? Yes, we'll make two. And then I need some steel. And that I know I have plenty of. So there's those four plates. One, two, three, four. And as a matter of fact, I should do and make a fifth. That way I can do this. And we've got the metal press. Perfect. Now, I think for the time being, I'm just going to put it over here by this. I'm, whoa, that shot me. Whoa, did you see that chicken go flying too? And he just went flying again. Oh, that's so funny. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. <laughs> Fast chicken. Awesome. Okay. So, one, two, three. Like so. And then... Um, I'm assuming these probably have to point the same direction. So we'll do this and this. Good. So they're both heading in the same direction now. And my piston. There we go. Can I wrench it? Can I wrench it into the right position or do I have to put a block up above? Oh, perfect. I never thought in a million years that that would actually work okay cool oh i need my hammer back those chickens are so funny they just keep flying around on that speed track um hammer hammer oh it's still there because i need to make more storage drawers i had no thought that i was going to need that anytime soon okay cool you're good to go now i just need to put like a storage chest on both sides and we will be good to go so let me just grab some vanilla chests um I made a whole bunch of wild you know what we're gonna grab these sky root I just I always avoid them and I don't use them for crafting so might as well use them for something useful right so let's put these chests right there and right there <clears throat> and now I don't want to run power over here so guess what I'm gonna do guys I'm gonna use my awesome new freaking traveling power node and we're going to go throw, you know, actually, just for poops and giggles, 
we're going to put the power thing above it too so i don't i'm not limited to just the power that it can, can provide but it kind of get, will get like a backlog of power so we're going to put you right there and you're on out right and then we're going to place our transfer node right up on top and place you in there <clears throat> um there it goes just had to connect all right cool and now you have power and let's go grab some ferris ingots and see if this works oh this will be awesome this will be so awesome F E R R. I have ingots we'll probably end up making a bunch of these so I'm going to throw all 40 in and that should give us 10 let's see if it works it doesn't want to work why don't you want to work do I need to pipe you in let's try that let's pipe you in I should have thought about that um, I'm gonna want it to be prettier eventually but for right now this will just have to work all right so eggs can go in you can go in wow storage drawers I can't believe I'm finally like I made so many of them I did not expect to be out already all right so there's you and then we'll put you right here perfect you're gonna be the insert and you just need to go to always active throw those in there still not working do I need to like drop them in from on top huh it's obviously going this way let me see can't <laughs> watching those chickens in the background is just too funny can I oh well I mean that's not what was just happening but let me what is going on here what's going on you should oh you know what I didn't put the press in and that's probably why it doesn't want to do anything that's what I'm gonna guess there's there's nowhere for it to go and nothing for it to do um, let me try to put these four on now oh there it goes okay cool so one two three four is that what it needed is it five I thought it was four what's going on why aren't you working are you not getting power the metal press has power why are you not working why 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 let us put this chest here again and try to put you in there and we'll try to do it from on top like so yes now you're gonna be on insert you're gonna be on always extracting oh this is becoming so frustrating so so frustrating the metal press has power do I need okay one last option here I thought I had this like I thought I was totally squared away on this um, let's do this let's put an extra one right here like that and then I can just oh no that's not what I want that pick that up pick it up there we go so we're gonna put the chest right here and put this right down here there we go and I'm gonna need my wrench for this one and um, north sky root chest no south north engineer yeah no that's gonna just be on south that's oh up not south up and put you in there there it goes oh there it goes oh there we go oh there we go except I made a press and I don't want to press I want a gear <laughs> no come back <laughs> okay let me <laughs> that was just silly of me so silly of me that's not what I wanted to do I wanted a gear um, so let's do that again so I need some steel but hey at least I know it works yay for that uh, one two three four <laughs> I needed a gear one two three four and let us make a real cheap gear um, do I have any oh I've got tons let's just grab an iron one real quick so that's what I don't want 
those. I want metal gears. Oh, how silly of me. But it's working, and that's a good thing, and that means we're headed in the right direction. So swap that out. Cool. I'll just put you in here for right now. That, that looks like a good place for you. Let's put the Ferris back in there. There we go. There we go. Gear. Ferris gears. Yeah, I feel awesomely accomplished right now. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So now we can go make the next level of um, machine frame, which then we make the next level of machine frame. And we're going to have to do that on the assembly table. Um, I believe that was the recipe. I think one makes the next one, right? Um, that's a machine frame. Why? Oh, there they are. Okay. So you are going to be with a regular machine frame, a bronze ingot, and vibrant alloy. Okay. Do I have any? I do. I've got the one. Um, I need to make, not alloy, alloy. I need to make these gears, which are made. Do I have any? Oh, I do. Cool. So there's, oh, it was like four of them, I think. Was it four? How many was it? Um, <laughs> oh, I can just do this. Uh, right. Er, stop. There. You make... Oh, no, not you. Um, okay, so it's just one. And then some bronze ingots. Cool. So we've got that. We've got that. And some bronze. One, two, three, four. It was four of those. That's what I needed four of. All right, cool. And as a matter of fact, to speed this process up, what I might do is break away here real quick because I really want to make um, some more lasers. And I keep forgetting to do it because I haven't been using the table. And so it's going to take a minute. I mean, the it shouldn't be too bad once they all go blue. But that's really slow. So while that's going, I'm going to go ahead and break away real quick. And I'm going to make at least one more row of lasers. Maybe two more rows since I have room for two. And um, that means I might have to go to the nether. Because I don't know how many rubies I have. I've got 47 rubies. That's going to be enough for 20, 23. Yeah, that'll be enough for 23 lasers. Oh, you know what? I might be able to do that right now. Um, lasers. Because I started the black, the dark steel, so we've got tons of that. And the redstone alloy. How many can I make? I can make 23. I scratched that. We don't have to go anywhere. Um, I just need the conduit for it. There's 15 of you. And to make you, I need that. So I need you. Okay. There's a whole bunch of those. Cool. And then I think I'm out of vibrant. Nope. Not out of vibrant, but I need more. So I'll start that up. Um ender pearls grab a stack of you and alloy yes and i'm up to like six thousand of that now so that's cool and i can put you in here which will be super fast right bink bink super fast <clears throat> sweet i like speed i like the way things are coming along um i'm i'm happy uh we have progression which is really really good and now let me bring up the conduits again and we're going to make more of you. So we got plenty. Perfect. Now we got 39. That, well, we only have 23 lasers, so that should be more than enough. So we're going to go ahead and just do this while it's cooking up. I am so excited right now. I don't know about you guys, but I am so excited. I, I'm ready and like, you know, to make some, you know, forward progress. And oops, that was, let me turn you back on. Boop, pick all that stuff up. There we go. And let's go ahead and one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so that's going to be 20 that I can add. And then I can add in the corners too. And that will give us our 23 lasers that we can add in. So one, get to work. Get to work, guys. Get to work. Yeah, do good stuff. Um, I wonder if I'm going to short out the system here. Did it, did it finish? Did it just finish right then? Oh, it just finished right then. Cool. And so you should be in the chest. All right, cool. So now we got to make our next level up. So let's go see what we, I think it's going to be Signillum. Um, machine frame is this one right here. So I'm going to need a Signillum gear with that frame, some shiny we got, and then this pulsating crystal, which is pulsating iron and an ender diamond. This is simple, 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 simple. So let's make you. There we go. 
Um, I don't know if there's space. Oh, there's space. Okay. So randomly there's space. Oh, but I need that. Um, uh, so pulsating crystal. My inventory's going to get so full until I put the storage drawers in. Um, I got the machine frame on me or in the drawer. And what else did I need? Uh, shiny. There we go. Got plenty of that. One, two, three, four. And do I have enough signillum? I don't. Signillum has a pretty e easy recipe, if I remember right, in the induction smelter, I think. Where is the ingot? There it is. I can make you... Um, oh, okay. Alloy smelter works. That's copper, silver, and redstone. We can do that. We can do that. So, copper. Not copper. Copper. Stack of you. Silver. Stack of you and redstone. Don't need a lot right now, just enough to get this mission complete. So there should be nothing in here. Oh, no, there is silicon. Boop, boop, boop. All right, signalum, go. Oh, you're like kind of terribly slow. Okay. Well, let's put the rest of the stuff back. Um, I don't need any more vibrant. I don't need the can. I'll get this all cleaned up later. Um, so that's I need you, you. Um, the gear and the other machine frame. Cool. We're good. Can is there any room for you? How about you? How about you? How about you? Okay. All of a sudden there's room again. So signalum should be hot four. Got it. Awesome. Now we've got our signalum gear. Put you in there real quick. Go, 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 go. Why aren't you going? Didn't I? Oh, good grief. It's, trying to get picked up by my stupid stupid thing okay so machine frame it oh let me grab the other one all right so machine frame gear shiny and go cool oh yeah oh yeah that's what i'm talking about that is what i am talking about actually i'm not talking about anything but that just is such a cool saying that's what i'm talking about all right so i wonder if that's what willis was talking about was that what willis was talking about or not Willis, who was it? Um, oh, I forget what show that was from. That's so long ago. All right, and you and you. One, two, three, four. It just so happens that it's, I made like literally the perfect amount to make a nice little perfect square. I'm kind of okay with that. Of course, I still got that extra outer row, but whatever's. And how much faster is this with all these extra lasers? Well, um, it, it's got to be a bit faster. I mean, of course, this one probably takes longer because it's higher level, but this is good stuff. And finally, you in this corner. Oh, yeah. Decent amount of lasers now. I got to figure out what the max is that you can do and eventually get to max because... I like rocking the max. But anyways, now black plastic. While that's working, that's the other thing we got to do. We got to figure out how to make black plastic. Um, how do we make black plastic? You are made from squid plant seeds, which I don't have, or the plastic mixer. And if I remember correctly, that's actually one of the next missions over here. The plastic maker. Cool. So let's get started on that. Because there's something else I want to make for this system over here. And I'll explain what I did uh, off camera in just a minute. So, plastic maker. Okay, there's the plastic maker. Gouch, you're easy. Got you. That should be achievement complete, right? Wait. What do you... Oh. Uh, Thermopneumatic processing plant. Okay. Um, thermo pneumatic processing plant. This guy. Um, that should be easy too. What am I short? Glass. See, got, I got all that. Do I not have any more of the pipes? Is that what I'm missing? Am I missing pipes? Let me put those in and let's see if that was it. Oh no, it's the redstone. That's what it was. I just took all my redstone out of here. So let us put you right there. Boop. Like that. Okay, cool. Now we should be good. 
thermo pneumatic processing plant. Got it. Perfect. Cool. Plastic maker done. And then I wonder if the mixer will work too. Okay. Let me just grab this stuff and get it out of there. Ooh. Which one was that? That's the plastic mixer. Cool. So that was two achievements back to back. Cool. And then there's some other stuff to do. All right. Now this guy, these are all going to kind of go together. One of these needs a heat source. And so I found these vortex tubes. After doing some research, these vortex tubes are enough to heat up the refinery. So I don't have to do the lava that kept turning to obsidian. So that's awesome. I'm very, very happy about that. However, I need a lot of pressure. And the other one just wasn't quite cutting it. But these liquid compressors, I can fuel with the um, the LPG. Is that what it's called? LPG? I, it doesn't say the name of it. I think it's LPG. It's in one of these. Um, yeah, LPG, right? <clears throat> so we can kind of refine and go right back into it and power it. So it kind of creates a cyclical relationship. So we should be okay there. However, they're terribly weak and they only go a little over one. So I need to make some speed upgrades for them. And now you'll see how all of this ties together and I'll be so excited. To make a speed upgrade, I need to be able to make lubricate and bucket. And the lubricant bucket is a byproduct of the thermonomatic processing plant. So diesel, which we just made some of, right? And redstone will give us lubricant, right? So we got to get this guy going. We got to get this guy going. And I also need to make the black plastic. So either way, we got to make the one before the other because that's how I'm going to get the pressure up in this thing. So there's that but I need a heat source for it. So right now, I think I'm just gonna do old school um, nether rack and fire. I think that's gonna work. I did try that with the diesel plant, but it just, it didn't seem to be all that effective. I wasn't I wasn't liking the production of it, so. So anything I don't need, let me put back real quick. Um, I'm gonna need you eventually. All right, so we're gonna need some nether rack, which I've got my dev null right there. That's awesome. And then I've got, okay, cool. And I've got my uh, <clears throat> my 2.0, my flint and steel 2.0 in my tool bag. So we're gonna put you here like so and just break you. All right. And right now it has no heat, temperature 22 degrees. But if we bust out our flint and steel and do a little clicky click like that, temperature should be going up. Perfect, perfect. Now, how much diesel do I have in here? Okay, I've got at least enough to make a bucket. So what I might do is get a drum. That might be what I do. And I can do in and out on that one. Um, my drums are in here, like so. There we go. And I'm gonna need a bucket. And, oops, come on, bucket. There we go, I got six of them. That'll work. All right, and so hopefully I'll be able to pull the diesel out like right here. Um, you know, what? I'll just do this. So you're gonna be in and out and you're gonna be active. And then you're gonna be putting in oil, but you're gonna put out diesel into this, right? No, you just put oil into that. That is not what I wanted. That is not what I wanted. Um, let's send this back into the ender tank real quick. Oh, that's not going to work. I'm just going to have to get another drum. I'm going to have to get another drum. I'm going to have to turn that other <laughs> the other tank off just for a moment so I can get the diesel out. Oh, goodness. And do I have redstone on me? Let me grab that redstone while we're at it because we need to make that lubricant. So redstone. Redstone. There we go. Like so. All right. So let's let's switch this around real quick. You're going to go back to inactive. Oops. There we go. And then I'm going to... There we go. Now we've got the diesel. Awesome. Cool, cool, cool. We're heading in the right direction. So now I put the diesel in here, right? And I put some redstone in there. And we should get some lubricant. Sweet. One bucket of lubricant. Now, can I just right-click on you? Or shift right-click to get that? No. I'm going to need another drum. <laughs> And like a, a conduit. Okay, we got this. Conduit, like so. And another drum. 
All right. There we go. <clears throat> and hopefully this will pump that out. So there we go. And drum right there. Perfect. And then we'll set you to always active. There we go. So now we got some lubricant. Okay, so I got a bucket of lubricant now. Now, that was to make the speed upgrades, right? Speed upgrades. Like so. Okay, I'm going to feel a little bit cheaty here. I'm not going to do it. I, I'm not going to do it. Um, because <laughs> if you guys remember, if I were to do this and put that there like that, it would allow me to cheat because uh, it won't use the liquid in the buckets and I ain't trying to cheat. So let's see what one speed upgrade does. If not, I'm going to pause and kind of grind out these speed upgrades because I could just shift click see and it doesn't use the bucket. And so I could, I could be cheaty. I could be cheaty, but I'm not going to, I'm not going to cheat. Um, I kind of want to like throw that away. I don't know. It's, is it cheaty? If I'm, I'm not, I'm not technically cheating. All right. Speed upgrade. Okay. So a little bit of a boost and that took me from like 10 liters to 15 liters. Yeah. So I need a lot more air. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to break here. Um, I need this to really heat up. I need, how, how do I get you to heat up a little bit better without burning all my trees down? I guess I could put netherrack here and do the fire on the sides. Or maybe I'll just do a couple buckets of lava. And, I don't know. I'll figure it out. I'm going to get some more uh, diesel done so I can make some more lubricant, make more speed, and then we'll be right back. I just want to cut this in so you guys can kind of see. I really do sit around and just do some really grindy stuff in between. So I just thought I'd kind of show you. It's funny. This was literally just back and forth, back and forth, constantly placing lava there just so I can keep the thing hot enough to produce or to, you know, uh, refine the oil and stuff like that. But I just thought it'd be funny to show you how long I was waiting in between and just doing this over and over again. So anyways, back to the video. All right, Traveler, so I just finished making my last speed upgrade. It was pretty fast and easy once I got it. And like I said, I didn't want to be cheaty. So I hooked up a drum to my uh, fluid trash can. And every time I would make one, I would dump that bucket of the lubricant out and put it over here. <clears throat> and then, yeah, it would, it would drain that. So basically, now... Oh, you know what? I can grab this frame over here. Grab you. We should be just about ready to make some plastic. Oh, look at that achievement. Um, because this is all empty now and it's still got good heat. So to make that, I think this is where I'm gonna need some LPG, which actually this tank, that's, is that my LPG? No, no, which one? This is my gasoline tank. LPG is over here. So what I'm gonna do now is, oh, yeah, there we go. Um, we're going to bring this one over down to our plastic machine and trust me, I will make this all prettier. This is going to be prettier, but for the time being, I'm just trying to kind of get all connected right now. So I just want to disconnect all these. There we go. So now the LPG that we're producing in here will go straight into here. Okay. And also when, oh, well, let me put the speed upgrades in. So upgrade like that and upgrade like that. So that should get the pressure like way up. Maybe not way up. I thought it would go higher. Oh, it's going, it's going. And now that that's going higher, these should be getting hotter. So yeah, now that's at like 130, which means our temperature is coming back up. Awesome. So then that oil will constantly be producing kerosene and LPG sweet. Then our LPG will get extracted out of here and into this bad boy over here, right? Right. Um, let's just do you on extract. That's LPG in there, right? Is it? No, it's going up, not down. Why are you not extracting? Why are you not extracting? Can't you go into the top here? Oh, because you're on insert. That 
Oh, there's gasoline in there. How did that get in there? How in the world is my... Yeah. How did I... Ma oh, when I was connecting all those crazy pipes. That makes sense. Okay. So, let's put you down. Dude, don't, don't jump in the fire. Don't jump in the fire. Come on, I'm not trying to make bacon here. Alright. Okay, so LPG is going in. Awesome. Now, that's really loud. I'm going to have to put like a sound muffler over there. Because I have security upgrades, I believe they're called. And um, basically what those do is uh, make it so I can get to max pressure and they won't blow up. As, as far as I understood it. So this one has a security upgrade and then these both now have security upgrades. And so if the pressure goes over like five or whatever, when it gets to that red zone, they'll discharge air instead of blowing up like I did uh, last time. Yeah, so I'm trying to avoid that. So now if I put coal in here, it should start making plastic. Ah, uh, yeah, I see plastic. Where did that go then? Oh, it's going to this drum over here. Well, I kind of wanted you to go that way. I wasn't thinking. So let us pick these two up. And we'll just do the same thing, but on this side. So you're going to be on extract. You're going to be on insert. And I see plastic in there. I see plastic in there. Awesome. And then I want this to also fill for right now. Just, well, because why not, right? And you don't need to be connected. Okay. So you've got plastic going in. You're like 8,000 buckets now. 9,000. Okay, cool. So we need to go make some dyes. That's what we need to make. So I need red, green, and blue. So blue. Blue dye. Not light blue. Just regular blue. Where's re lapis? I need like regular blue dye. Or does it have to be lapis? Okay, how do you make you? I want a regular blue dye. Ha, huh, that's what I want. There's no... Okay, so lapis it is. Not a problem. I got plenty. Full stack of lapis. There we go. And I need some green. Cactus green. There we go. Um, and I need some red. So this one I can make with my Technicolor Essences and just do... Ooh, that was way more than I wanted to do. Okay. I don't need all that dye. And there's probably nowhere for you in my system to go, so you're just going to sit there for a minute. But let's see if this makes the black plastic. So dye, dye, dye. Sweet. And I believe if I click on this, all I got to do is just click it, and I... Oh, 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 I get it! Okay. So it was you, you, and back to that machine casing now. Oh, this has been so much longer than I had intended. Um, machine casing. Steel casing. That's what you're called. That's a steel ingot. That's what that was. That is a steel ingot. Or a couple of them. I don't know. <clears throat> That's what you were. Okay. So now if I go back to my chest over here, you should have enough pressure. So if I throw you and you, and I don't know how many steel ingots I needed. And I need to make sure I turn you off. There we go. So did that throw the frame in there? I didn't see. What's going in? Is it going in? Okay, so there's the plastic. Oh, I already picked up the frame. Okay. And steel casing. Not dacing. Casing. That was how many ingots? Four ingots. Okay. So one, two, three, four. And I should get it. Oh, give me that bad boy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And now you've opened up. Okay, cool. So now we've got some more stuff to work on. But I think this was pretty good. I'm going to take the time to get this all cleaned up in the meantime and really figure out how I want it. But that thing is nice and hot now, which means this is staying nice and hot. And I just need a place for the kerosene. Um, yep, yeah, the gasoline is going over here. Should be. If I set this up right the other day. Yes. So you can see I've got the gasoline going over to my tank. Oh, look at that. It did all that iron. Oh, it did all that iron. Oh, look at that. Oh, this is awesome. Things are coming along. Oh, by the way, I, don't, I just want to show you. I put up a little barrier because cows kept jumping in here and dying. And first of all, I want the cows for the move fluids. But also, they kept freaking putting blood in my system. I didn't want that. So I did that. 
But anyways, yeah, I just need to connect out the kerosene, and then we will basically have this kind of creating unlimited stuff because it all comes down to the oil and the LPG, which are both coming from my farms in the last millennium. So, yay, we've got the plastics now. I'm very happy about that. That makes me very, very happy, and I just need to figure out a way to auto-populate these eventually, but I think that's going to be waiting until we get to applied energetic stuff where I can put it um, on. What are you doing, dude? How did you... How did you jump up there? You know, you're going to get stuck there for the rest of the season. I don't, I don't think you're going to be able to get off. But anyways, let us, it's already gone longer than I wanted, um, but we got to do some chance cubes. I didn't do chance cubes last episode. I think we should do some chance cubes. Um, also, I didn't say it in the uh, last episode. I meant to mention it, um, but I'm glad someone made a comment about it. Um, yeah, the blazing pyrothium. I didn't know that's what that was. And that's really, really cool, uh, that you did because that's, that's a heck of an eye to check that stuff out. But I will say one thing I did actually die. Well, didn't die, but, uh, my white stone actually got used and I did not know that. Um, I went back when I was watching the replay, I noticed it because I was sitting here one day during a full moon and all of a sudden the, the little sparkles started happening and I was like, what is, and this was filling back up. I actually would have died if I wasn't carrying that on me when I did the, the 32 chance cubes. So just want to let you guys know, I did happen to notice. I just, uh, I, I forgot to mention it last episode. Not that it really made a difference. I mean, like I said, my white stone, it saved me, but, um, that is just another example of me doing stupid things. I do stupid things a lot and yeah, that would have killed me. But fortunately I'm at least smart enough to keep my, uh, my, my stone on me. So that saved my life. So let's do a few cubes real quick. Um, let's go back over to where that blazing pot. Oh yeah. Look at all of them are still over here doing their thing. So we'll go a little bit away from all of them. So they don't bother me. What is it? This must've been something else that got blown up that I didn't even notice with all those chance cubes. Huh? All right. We're not going to do them all at the same time though. This time we're going to, we're going to savor all of them. A zombie. What are zombies doing down here? What the frick? Apparently zombies got out in the last one too. It was like an invisible TNT. Okay, cool. Put that in there. We we're hoping for something fun. Something fun and exciting. Okay, are you the real one or are you the fake one? Are you the real one or are you the fake one? Real or fake? Real or fake? I could always use some nether stars. Oh, this is the real one. No, it's not. Man, that's disappointment. I was really hoping that was going to be the real one. Wait. Come on, guys. Come on. I like. I hesitate to get close to these. Just negative potion effects, really. Can I get something good for once? Something good. I'm, I'm like making sure I'm clear to run. Okay. That's like going to fool. I knew it. I knew it. I was like, that's there to fool you. <sighs> Nothing good. I can never get anything good. They really are nerfed for bad things. Okay, so that must be where that blazing pyrothium came from. Um, let's just put you here. There we go. We'll just get rid of it that way. All right, here we go. Next one. Well, fireworks. That was kind of cool, but I didn't get anything cool out of it. So not as cool as I would like it to be. All right, come on. Something good. Four left. Four left. That obsidian roof. I'm not really sure what that's all about. I'm really not sure what that's all about, but doesn't seem to do anything. It doesn't drop anything. Um, well, some weird hieroglyphics, some stairs and a plank. I'm not sure. I'm some of these are just weird. Like, there's just no other way to put it. Some of them are just strange. Okay, break. Oh. I was, like, getting ready to fly away, and I stopped too early. Oh, hey, remember I talked about it. What it would be like to have a... Uh... Oh, I was hoping the music would keep going. Uh, a supercharged John Cena, and apparently that was it. And uh, did he? Okay, I was like, I'm checking my white zone. Did he kill me? Uh, here we go. Last one. Oh, 
Oh, that's just annoying. That That's just annoying. Well, all right. We'll just leave all those creatures here in the end and let them do their thing. And we will head back. So, yeah, I, I would say this is another productive uh, episode in the way of progression. And we're getting that much closer to being able to finish off Alpha. But not only finish off Alpha, but just kind of continue on. Um, oh, the piggy got off. I was really hoping he was going to be like stuck there for the rest of the season. Um, I'm going to have to figure out a way to kind of keep this under control so it's not always overflowing. Maybe if I like reduce the number of speed upgrades, it'll just keep like a perfect amount of air in there. Maybe that'll do it. I don't see it dropping too much. I mean, it is dropping. I'll test it out. I just don't want that overflow constantly going. I want like a perfect amount of air in there. So we'll work on it and we'll see how it goes. But anyways, uh, this episode is another one. I want to do my little shout outs to you guys, to all the brand new subscribers. It's been a really good for week for me. Um, it's, you know, relatively speaking, uh, we've had like 14 new subscribers this week, which is huge since that's more than I've had over like the last couple months. So, um, I will go ahead and put those names up right now. And, uh, I'm not going to read them off, but, um, yeah, I just want to thank you guys for, you know, joining on to the family and supporting. And uh, before I do finish up, I do want to say one thing. And this is mostly to those of you who are still watching. Those are the people who actually, you know, enjoy the videos and enjoy the kind of the community and stuff like that and actually chat and put comments up. I've been thinking about doing a discord for this channel, a place where we can all kind of come together, uh, talk about, you know, what Project Ozone or Minecraft or absolutely anything in general and just kind of be able to communicate with each other and possibly use it as a method to set up like, you know, activities as a group where we could do like a server and do some fun events like that. So I'm doing that. I'm, I'm mentioning that at the end of the video because I really want to just do that for the people who actually do watch the videos and watch them kind of all the way through and all that fun stuff. So if that is something that interests you guys, please let me know because that is something I would actually like to do with you guys. And, uh, you know, kind of just be able to talk to you on a more free basis, not just wait for comments on the videos and stuff like that. So let me guys, let me know down in the comments if you guys would like me to set up the discord by saying something like, Hey, yeah, set up a discord. Cool. And, uh, we can get that set up for everybody. And I also do want to say that for those of the name, for those who have subscribed and are watching stuff like that, that I didn't put your name on the list, I do apologize, but I can only put up what I can see. So if you ever said to, you know, don't show who you're subscribed to, I don't know. So I do apologize, but I do appreciate you guys as well. But with all that being said, we'll go ahead and finish up now. So y'all know the deal. I'm Slaughter Havoc and I am out of here. Peace.